you guys ready to learn some classic arcade hacks and cheats from a couple of arcade hackers and cheaters? Yeah. Let's do this, because every day's a new day, and we're gonna hack today to make it an awesome one. This one big dude, nice. People don't know this and you shouldn't tell anybody because it's a big secret. If you do it in the right combination, it'll actually spit out cold hard cash. Here's all the prizes. How many tickets do you think we got? That was a lot higher than I thought, right? We crossy roads for the win. Yeah. <laughs> Today for homeschool, we're going to go to a wildlife museum. That's going to be awesome, so we're gonna do that first. And then after that, we're going to the arcade and we're gonna try out some fun hacks and cheats and ways to get extra tickets or tokens or whatever so that you can dominate your friends at the arcade. Yeah! I got these new plants and these new pots to put in the kitchen and they look really nice, huh? Yeah. I've decided that this house needs some more like life and some fresh air and so we got these cute little succulents and everything and some aloe vera. Doesn't this one totally remind you of Nintendo like Mario Brothers? It would be fun to get like a little Yoshi or Mario or Luigi or something and like put down in here so because it totally feels like Mario Brothers doesn't it yeah it reminds you of that these little tiny colorful cactuses they're really cute this one actually grows flowers on it in the spring I'm not sure when if it's in the spring or when it gets a certain size but yeah supposedly this little white puffball cactus it will sprout an entire pink flower on the top so it'll be exciting we'll have to keep an eye on that and make sure to keep it happy and healthy huh yeah this cactus right there, that's one that Kyle picked out. Yeah. You thought it was a little funny, didn't you? <laughs> that one, yeah, that one looks a little funny, I don't know. <laughs> Are you ready? Yeah. To the museum, let's go. go. Museum first. <laughs> Luke, to the museum. Okay, let's go. Let's go. It's not working, so we're sneaking around. Oh, more life hacks and cheats. Oh no. <laughs> guys, we just landed in Africa. Are you guys ready to explore Africa? This is so cool. Wow, it totally feels like you're legit in Africa right now, huh? Although I don't think in the wild there's this many animals this close together, but <laughs> this is cool. Look how this place is all laid out. Oh, I love how wide open it is. How awesome. It feels like the lion just gonna stand up and come right I know, right? So they look realistic. so lifelike. Oh, they've got one taken down over there. You can see it's all Ooh. getting chewed on. They have these little audio things. See, listen. I don't know if you can hear that. Okay, that's it. I, mine's done. Is it? That's awesome. Yeah, we have these little wand things. So you push the number based on the section that you're in and then it tells you all about the wildlife. On behalf of Jimmy and Marianne and the museum staff, we hope you'll enjoy your international safari to the wild, Africa, Asia, Whoa, guys, look, there's baboons right there. Those are really cool looking. Look what's inside this cave, guys. You oh, see that? Yeah. <gasps> A big American alligator. Oh my gosh, that's creepy. That's huge. Look at this little spring hair guy. Doesn't that look like a Pokemon character? It doesn't even look real. This is just the happiest bear I've ever seen. Isn't he the happiest bear ever? Yeah. <laughs> this is the interactive children's exhibit where you can actually touch and hug the animals and stuff. It's really cool. Yeah, they have a black bear over here. Oh, 
Oh. Hey, they look so cuddly, yeah, huh? Yeah, so cuddly. It's too bad in the wild they would just take your head right off, huh? Exactly. Yeah. Oh. Whoa, these are really cool. Giant bugs, huh? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Those are really cool. Look at that beetle. Looks like he's ready to go to battle, doesn't he? Yeah. yeah. Like he's yeah. ready to go troll go yeah. troll hunting or something. This yeah. Beetle, he's all armored up with his war paint and everything. Yeah. Oh, here is a whole bunch of tarantula hawks. These have one of the most painful stings in the world, and they live around where we do, huh? You guys have I seen saw, this. I saw one like, dragging a tarantula across their sidewalk. Yeah, they actually the kill and eat the tarantulas, and and Luke saw one in the driveway. He's dragging one across it, the driveway. Spooky! <laughs> This display is really cool, isn't it? You've got a white tail a mule deer, actually, with a, a mountain lion attacking it. And the way that they set that up is way cool looking. Look at that. That's what the antlers are for. It like, blocks the mountain lion. Defend itself, right? Yeah. And it also provides camouflage when it's going through all the deadfall and leaves and stuff. That's all we're going to show of our museum tour today. If you want to see the rest of it, we're going to have an exclusive tour of the rest of the museum with us and the kids on our Facebook page. So make sure and go watch that video and check it out. We just finished filming our Facebook exclusive museum tour. Are you guys ready to go to the arcade and reveal yeah. our hacks and cheats and secret codes and all that? Let's, let's do it. Let's go. Now we're at the arcade and now we're gonna show you some of our tricks and tips to win tons of prizes and tickets at the arcade. Are you ready guys? Yeah! yeah. Let's do this. Woo! Hack number one. Stay away from the games that require just random chance. For example, the ball drop games. You're not going to win very many tickets on it because you have no control, you can't practice, and you can't use your skill to win big. Let me show you what I mean. We've got a token in here. Go ahead and hit the ball drop button. There's no skill involved whatsoever. The ball, whoa, it just fell right into the hole. <laughs> so you drop the ball. And that's it. So you get 20 points. There's no skill. You have no control. You can't get better and you can't win big. So avoid games like that. A game like this requires more skill so you can get better. But there's still a lot of random chance. So this is kind of in, in between. So we're just trying to get points by bouncing them. At least you can aim and get more points. There you go. We only won one more ticket than on the crazy random drop game. So I would say that that this one is not that much different than this one because once you throw the ball, you really don't have much skill left. This is a ball drop game that's very similar, only you get to choose when the ball drops. And you actually oh, aim for... Or... Yeah, like that. You can rapid fire, so you can actually hack you can practice and you can get good like me. I can win up to 50 tickets. All I gotta do is be good at the game. Woo! Let's see. If I got more than 22, then I proved my point. Skill is where you get the tickets. 40 tickets, so we doubled the amount of tickets for the same amount of money. Each game was a dollar, and so always pick the games that require skill so that you can actually win. If you're really good at a game like Crossy Road, then you can win a ton of tickets. Last time I played this game, I won 102 tickets in one game. How are you doing this? 
I'm gonna get the high score right now, I swear. Oh no. Oh no! Oh! 145 tickets in one game, right? Pulls everything else out of the water because it's up to skill, not chance. That's your hack. I just got the new high score on this game, and so I got a bonus 500 tickets as well. We just won a giant jackpot, you guys. New high score. For real. Can you believe your dad just did that? No. I no. set the new arcade high score for Crossy Roads in this arcade. Woo! You get a lot in the cards, you can win a bunch of tickets. Here's how you cheat. You, instead of dropping one coin, you drop all of them at the same time as fast as you can. All right, Kyle, let's see if your life hack works. Ready? You don't stop pushing that button until you're all the way out of credits. Okay. Mark, say go. Let's see what you can do here. Oh, oh, you're already getting a bunch of droppers. And a new coin even, oh. or a new uh, card. There you go, okay, you're done. Look at them all dropping. Woo, you just won big, dude, nice. Yeah. They're still falling down there. Look, you're still getting a push, still. Yeah. That hack totally works. Let's do it one more time, because there's a bunch hanging on there. That was a good drop. Okay, you're out of tokens. Let's see. Oh. Oh, a big coin drop. I think that was another successful coin drop run. Yeah. Arcade hack number three is where you can win cold hard cash and beat the claw machine even if there's no money inside. People don't know this and you shouldn't tell anybody because it's a big secret, but there's actually secret codes to these joysticks and buttons. If you do it in the right combination, it'll actually spit out cold hard cash. Right? Yeah. Here's the cheat code. Show them, Dad. Okay, you have to do this exactly right without messing up with the right timing. Ready? Up, up, down, down, left, right, left. Right, catch, catch, down, up, down, up, left, right, pause, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, down, up, right, left, down, catch, catch, up. Okay, it should be reset, now we swipe the card. If we did this right, Luke, then just play the game and see what you get. It shouldn't matter, it'll drop money if we did it right. Right? Yeah. Did you get anything? No. Nope. It doesn't matter. Okay, let's see. Did you hear that? Yeah. Something dropped. Let's Look see. in my. Is there something in there? Oh, oh my gosh. Dude. <laughs> what? Cold hard there is cash. really cold hard cash. Look at all that money. Oh my gosh. How many hundreds are in there? I don't so know. Oh money. my gosh. We just won the jackpot, dude. It oh totally worked. <laughs> Show them how much that is. There's like a rubber band on it. Yeah, oh geez. Goodness. That's all $100 oh bills. Yeah. <laughs> Only one thing to do when you have all this cold hard cash. Should we make it rain right in the middle of the arcade? Yeah. No, we shouldn't. We should okay. put it in our pocket and go home. Okay. That's another trick is you never throw your money in the air for other people to take. There you go. Good job, Luke. It worked. Our final arcade cheat and hack has to do with not winning tickets, but beating your friends at air hockey. Everybody loves air hockey. It's the fun game where the pucks and these, uh, these slammers float on a cushion of air that's puffed up through all these little holes in the table. The trick to winning this game is how hard and fast you can get the puck moving at different crazy angles. And the main trick to do with this game is how you hold the slammer. Most people see the handle and they put their hand right on top, but experienced players know that you can get more power out of your slams if you put your fingers in the cup like this and get a motion going with your wrist. When you hold your slammer instead of like this, 
you hold it like this with your fingers on the cup, you can get way more speed out of it. See? It's just like a straight shot, they won't even see it coming. You'll be twice as fast as your opponent. There you have it, a final score of seven to three. So the new grip technique like this is gonna win almost every time. That's it for our arcade hacks today, you guys. We hope you guys learned something. Let us know if you try it and which ones work and which ones didn't down in the comments below. I just got another new high score, guys, really quick. I just put it twice in a row. 177 and 500 bonus tickets for a second high score. I don't think you're gonna beat it if you just pick a game and get really good at it. Let's see how many tickets it actually gives me here. 504 tickets in one game, you guys, on just one game. There it is, the daily high score, and I am the holder. Kyle, should we see how many tickets we got and what prizes we won? Yeah. Let's go cash them in. Here's all the prizes. How many tickets do you think we got? Uh, 2,000. 2,000? I don't know. At least $1,500. I think it's definitely think over 1,000. Right. I know for a yeah. fact it's over 1,000. Yeah. Well, let's see what we can get. Number 10. Oh. 4, 169 tickets. That was a lot higher than I thought, right? We, crossy roads for the win. Yeah. <laughs> we have enough tickets to get a mini air hockey table and a mini pool table, <laughs> plus candy bars and stuff afterwards. Yeah. So we won, didn't we? Yeah. <laughs> we won all these in one day. We, we did. We got the air hockey table and the pool table and we got a bunch of candy and two bouncy balls and we won all of this in just one day using our our hacks and and cheats and stuff like that. We had a good time, didn't we? Yeah. You guys don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications if you haven't already and click anywhere on the screen in order to uh, watch other videos and playlists and uh, don't forget to go check out our Facebook video as well yeah. that we did our exclusive behind the scenes tour of the museum and we'll see you guys next time. Bye!